know, we decided to postpone today's workout. Um, some players and pitchers in particular were able to get a light recovery workout in this morning. Um, and we, we do expect results at some point, uh, testing results at some point today uh, from, you know, and, and this will help us uh, clear things up. Uh, and assuming that we're all clear, we'll, we'll pick this back up tomorrow on, on our regular schedule and today's workout will just uh, be handled tomorrow. Um, and we, we really don't believe this is gonna hurt our, our camp or development just to miss a day and be a nice mental blow for our players. So um, that's what I have for you and happy to answer any questions or things that are on your mind. With that, uh, if you'd like to ask a question, use the raise hand feature on Zoom or type into the chat window and we'll get this thing started. We've got a question from Janie, AP. Janie, go ahead. Okay, Gabe, are, are you confident that that everything can can come together? I mean, this I asked you yes, you know, less than twenty four hours ago, how grateful you were that you hadn't had any delays, and now. Here we are. Um, do you think that baseball and testing can get situated in time to, for this to work out? Are you still confident? D David Force said yesterday with, with the A situation, MLB has to get better and we believe it will. That we, he, he's confident, but where, what's your take today? I mean, here you are in the same situation. Yeah, no, I, I feel as confident today as, as I did yesterday. Um, under, I understand that there are going to be hiccups along the way. I think our, our club does as well, um, our players and staff included in that. And yeah, I, I still have confidence for sure. Is it frustrating? Do you, do you understand better maybe today what these other clubs were, were dealing with the last couple of days? I think more than anything, I, I just maintain a level of empathy uh, for everybody that's working really hard to get our camp. Uh, our camp up and running, but also across the league and for all the clubs that are working really hard to put um, their players in a position to have success. It's, it's nobody, nobody expected this to be easy and everybody is doing the best that they can. Thank you. Maria, go ahead. Hey Gabe, um, how did Hi, the Maria. players kind of react to the delay and did you sense some frustration on their part over it? Yeah, I mean, because we're dealing with with so many players, Maria, we have uh, different, you know, varying levels of of comfort or or discomfort. And um, look, we we stay in very close contact with our players. I think you know most of the anxiety is is just around COVID in general. Um, but I don't think it's it's related in any way to you know anything other than what society in, in general is experiencing. Henry, go ahead. Good, good, good afternoon, Gabe. Um, hi, Henry. Hi. Uh, just, just a couple of things. Um, was this a significant number of tests? And by significant, I mean like a very, very large uh, group of results. Or was it just a, a smaller group, but enough to, um, you know, persuade you that uh, it just might be safer? Uh, I'm not sure what you mean. We don't have the number. The number of tests back. Right. We don't have results back yet. No, that, that's what I meant. I meant of the, the results that you're still waiting for. Some teams uh, have canceled workouts just because of a handful of tests that have not come back positive or negative yet. Right. I'm just wondering if that's the case that you're in or whether it was a significant number of tests. Because as of yesterday, we were told that the testing had uh, pretty much gotten everybody uh, one way or the other. So I think... The, the best way to express this is that Saturday's results, the, the results from Saturday's tests, aren't back yet. We're expecting them to be back uh, at some point today. Um, we've communicated with the league on that, and they're doing everything in their power to help us with that. Um, that's, that's all I have for you. Like, we don't have a specific number. We haven't separated it out. All, all I can tell you is that we don't have the results back from our tests on Saturday, and uh, that's why we made the decision that we made. Okay, and, and on a different front, um, the Washington Nationals today announced that uh, several players, uh, particularly some in the outfield, 
Uh, we're going to quarantine uh, as a result of the contact tracing procedure. Mm -hmm. um, before you canceled the workout today, were you going to have to uh, sit out any players based on the two positive tests that you had yesterday? Uh, we would have had the same procedures and protocols today that we had yesterday. So we don't have new information after yesterday's workout that would uh, make us change course in any way for today's workout. 